morning guys and girls welcome to another episode of Ken's Fishing glorious morning on the south coast we had uh, Darren's spot and uh, Darren's promising to put me in the bronzy this morning woke up to a bit of a uh, overcast morning but conditions are beautiful otherwise there's no wind and the water is looking machine so we'll see you guys just now cheers Having a look at the spot, a closer look. You notice we're wearing our catch cook gear this morning, so hopefully we catch something to cook. <laughs> yeah, so uh, so we're gonna put uh, cans on the fish this morning. Um, there's, a, there's a ledge here. A lot of rocks here. It's just the way it wave is now. You can see the rocks there. Yeah, I suppose, yeah. That's the ledge. That's the ledge. So, we took it to stand somewhere here and put it a bit further and then just bring it in slowly, slowly, slowly towards the, that shelf. And when you get close to that shelf, the bite is on. No mistake. <laughs> I reckon. No mistake. <laughs> All right, well, let's bait up. That's why that FG not is the one. We need to master that one. Well done! What? <laughs> That's a top run, people. Photo, Darren. Dust. 
Yeah, that's your too. <laughs> Cheers. See you later. Hola. Wow! Yo! Man, I was getting relaxed. I thought Darren's getting all the fish this morning. And perseverance, uh, that's fishing. Nice size. Number two, I changed my hook to uh, number two uh, ring soy. Managed to get this off. Uh, I actually went a bit heavier this time on my SL50 paired with my Pentagon Medium because I was trying for Russia. I'd actually given up on the bronzes there. But man, I'm so happy. <laughs> Cheers! Evening catch cookers. Yes, 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 it is me, Kent. Just had a bit of a makeover early on. Comb my hair a bit. <laughs> yeah, this evening uh, I'll be preparing you guys some fish nuggets. Um, I'm gonna be using the bream Dad and I caught earlier on in Upton 20. And some of the ingredients, simple spices, fish spice, some pepper, salt, an old South African favorite. Aramant. For the batter, some cake flour, some beer, mix it in a bowl, and we're gonna do the nuggets. So join me this evening as I prepare the bronze bean fish nuggets, and we'll catch it just now. Cool. Okay, in preparation, or well, before I prepare, I'm gonna slide over to uh, what Darren cooked earlier on. Let's check out what he made. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is fill it with the bream. It's just easier to use the scissors when you're cutting these fins off and out. And there, pictorials. Use a nice and sharp knife, just makes life easier. When we get down to the bone, you can hear the bone, we scrape along. Again, just glide it against the bone because you want all that flesh meat. Almost there. Now you will have a bit of the stomach bone on there, but it's easy. We just Cut it out. Okay, and we're just gonna do the other side of the bream. Again, just along the top, get to the bone. Take care when using a knife. 
young catch cook viewers. I've got uh, my daughter behind the camera this evening. And that's the other side filleted. This we're gonna chuck in the freezer for either fish soup or if I decide to use it as bait again. I will try not to waste any of the fish and uh, sustain for our futures. Uh, the limit on these is two per person and um, it's got to be a minimum of 38 centimeters or 32 I can't remember. But yeah, let's uh, conserve for the future and be a responsible fisherman. So next is our batter. I'm just going to wash it up quickly. Okay, so it's a simple fish batter. It's not a lot of fish so I'm just going to do a Handful of flour, handful of cake flour. Uh, the mess will clean it up just now. Some fish spice, uh, some aromat, a bit of salt, a bit of pepper. Okay, and Egg. Okay, egg mix that all up. Still quite dry. And I'll start ingredients. Yeah, in there. One sec. Ah, cheers. Just firing up the stove here. Yeah? So, I'll generously dose this with a dollop of oil. And for the healthy version, I'm going to do some without oil there. So, I'll just show you quickly how I'm going to be. Nuggets out. Just got a bit of flour and some of the seasoning in here to dust it first a after. So we're just gonna put these all in the batter. Now you'll see from my previous video I don't like to waste beans, so I've got the cheeks in here and that uh, portion with the bones that nobody likes. Uh, if your fan is anything like mine, they like their fish filleted without any bones. So just in the batter. I'm just gonna leave that for a few minutes to soak up and then I'll lightly coat it in the flour mix. All I'm doing is just doubling up on the, you know, that crunch afterness, you know, that deliciousness. Sizzle, I love that sizzle. I've also kept the skin on on the fish. Just to get preference, I like it like that. You can take the skin off. We don't mind about our skin. Cool, so we'll check you just now. I'm gonna just put a bit of sweet corn on, make a salad, and get April away.
Okay, these are looking nice and golden brown. That's how we know they're all ready. So I'm just gonna take these off. Oh. I didn't use too much oil and I didn't use a lot of spice. Oops. PB. <laughs> PB. No. Fish looking. looking black, yeah. really okay, we're just waiting for the other to get brown. It's getting there. I think these are all good to go. Peeps joining me here. Yeah? You're hungry? Yeah, we're gonna eat now. So this is what the final spread looks like, guys. We've got our fish nuggets, we've got our simple green salad, some corn, and we're gonna have a nice glass of white. Thanks for watching. Um, Madison's gonna do a, a taste test for us just now and give us the verdict on the chow. Okay, so I got my guinea pig here. She's gonna do a test, taste, or a taste test rather for us. Go for it. Mm. A little bit bony. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you, might have, you might have chosen some of those bony bits. Those are for me. Taste fresh. Taste fresh. Um, the beer isn't too overpowering. You can still taste. The fish. I just got it, yeah. Thumbs up. Oh, that's all I need. Thank you. Morning, guys and girls. Sorry, this. Lively. Same. Are you still recording? <laughs> 